Well, good morning guys, and I know I have filmed a lot of Hondas on the channel in the last couple of months, but I figured I'd make a comeback to YouTube and uh, start filming some tours of some cars. So let me know what you want to see. I'll see if I can get a hold of it. But uh, I figured one last Honda just to show you. Um, 8th Gen SI. Uh, this one is ridiculously clean, bone stock, and it was very, you know, these are very hard to find these days that aren't molested or have a lot of miles or beat on. So um, when we got one of these in, I really wanted to make a video of it. So you can see this one's in great shape. It only has around 60,000 miles on it. And uh, looks great. Exterior color on this is Nighthawk Black, I believe, from Honda. And it rides up here on um, these Cooper Xeon RSEHs. Let me get the rim size for you real quick. The 215 45R17s, so these are nice 17 inch, dark silver painted, aluminum alloy rims, four wheel disc brakes all around, independent suspension, limited slip differential, six speed manual with a K20, two liter inline four cylinder. As you can see coming back here, there would be a chrome exhaust uh, tip stock, but apparently it's missing. As you can see, SI badge, see this car was a one owner and as you can see these are very expensive tires um, and you still have some tread life on them they will probably need to be replaced sometime in the future this vehicle is for sale at exclusive auto sales of Long Island as you can see this one's got the black cloth interior with red accent and stitching throughout on the bolsters the armrest and the door panel over here Get a nice perforated cloth insert, soft touch materials all up top. Everything from the regular 8th gen Civic carries over to the SI. Um, automatic driver side window, down and up. Power windows, locks and mirrors on the door here. Get your traction control off. Miles per hour, kilometers per hour selection, reset, and your brightness adjustments over here. Down here, fuel cap and trunk release. Aluminum sport shift pedals, and I like how Honda did the floor mount pedal for the SI. Um, I don't, I don't believe the regular 8th Gen Civic has it. If it does, I'll add an annotation. Only a little bit of clutch, uh, clutch dig there. It's very common, this is a Long Island car, so traffic. Um, and this seat bolster is in really good condition for the age of the vehicle. As you can see, full leather wrapped steering wheel with sport bolsters on each side. Get your cruise control over here, channel and volume over here with mode. Get your headlamps on and off, turn signals. Then you get the premium audio system. I believe it's a six speaker setup um, from Honda. It sounds very good actually. Um, let's see if I can do a quick demo here. I don't want to get copyrighted, so. But anyway, it's a very good sound system. Single zone manual climate down here. Everything is computer selected, very nice to feel. Um, most of you who know these 8th Gen Civics know they're great. My favorite part about this car, and uh, these SIs are actually the first car I learned stick on. Um, very good gearbox, um, very solid. You know, it's just very nice. Let's see if I can dive up and find fifth. Um, left hand, so. Anyway, get your e-brake down here. Cup holders, hidden storage. And then I, this is a sliding adjusting uh, armrest. <clears throat> a lot of people made a big stink when Honda got rid of that from the 9th gen, so they had to bring it back. Um, 12 volt power outlet, get built in auxiliary down here, a little storage bin. Everything up here is very nice. You have uh, softer touch materials, kind of hard, um, all the way up to the dash where it switches over to just hard plastic, but everything is put together very nicely. Um, up top, you got a very plush headliner. It kind of reminds you of an 8th gen Accord a little bit. Full power sliding and tilting power sunroof. I just said power twice. <laughs> um, those controls are over here, and then you have your door controls over here for your reading lamps. Coming over here, got a nice big mirror. And really solid feeling uh, overhead visors there. And then coming down here, you have all the original owner's literature, and I mean everything. This car was a one owner. Um, as you can see, Maintenance that's been done, the owner's manuals, everything. All the receipts are in there for oil changes. Um, even the original warranty information for the tires from factory and stuff's in there. So, really clean example of an older SI. Go ahead and pop the hood and the trunk and take a look at the back seat. As you can 
see she's running great. Um, I haven't seen one of these in this clean in a very long time. Um, used to really want one back in the day. As you can see, I'm about six foot and I have pretty good room. You know, that's a driving position style seat. Both these seats are pretty much all the way back. And the 8th Gen SI had a lot of room, uh, especially for compared to a lot of cars in the class back in the day. As you can see over here, all interior materials follow through to the back, which I think is very nice. Uh, overall, pretty impressive. Nicely padded armrest for cup holders. One seat back pocket over here. And then coming to the trunk, you have all the original SI floor mats, 60-40 split fold seats, controlled through there. And of course the OEM kind of batwing spoiler that Honda gave you. Up under the hood here, Honda's K20, running strong, 2 liter dual overhead cam, VTEC motor, variable valve timing. I'll put the power on the annotations, um, power did vary throughout the years for the K-Series. Um, it was known for its very high red line. Try to do a 6-speed manual like I said with a limited slip differential. We'll go ahead and see how she sounds real quick. And then shut her down. Very high revving motor. Um, all right, guys. It's my first video back into YouTube for a while, but I hope you enjoyed watching this quick tour on this 2008 Honda Civic SI sedan. If you have any questions, as usual, do leave them below. I'm working on my video format. I'll try and get a little better with the tours. So, as always, subscribe for more.